What's up guys, welcome back to Let's Play Diablo 3, my name's Maddie, and uh, in the last video we, uh, what did we do, we were looking through some sort of drowned forest or something for the, uh, the beacons of light, and the beacons of hope, I believe, can't quite remember, it's been a couple of days since I played, anyway, um, yeah, so now we've got to enter the drowned temple, so let's go do that, okay. There's Alaric over there. So we're looking for a, for the second sword piece of the Stranger's Sword. So that's our purpose for being in here. Get a lag here. It's not usual. Okay, so I got a new ability, didn't I? Wave of Light, and I haven't really used it yet. I feel like the audio is a bit loud, guys. Sorry about that. Actually, I might just try and change that now. Uh, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that, guys. Um, yeah, so hopefully it's a little bit quieter now. You guys can actually hear me. Don't want those. Who's this guy? So there's our wave of light. I don't particularly like it. I don't like the effect of it. Um... According to its tooltip, it does a lot of damage, but... Oh shit. It's still gone. There's more, okay. I guess it is kind of cool. Okay, so I'm lagging here a bit, guys. Sorry about that. Shit move. Okay. I don't have enough speed. Kill some of these little creepy dudes. Okay. Alright, there we go. Done. Alright, so Alaric's here. Your strength rivals that of our greatest champions. What now do you think you are? You may enter our most secret place. Okay, thanks, mate. The spirit speaks the truth. This was a good the noble human Magda fought his way here just to die. Magda. And who is this you bring with you? Adria's daughter? She has power within her. No matter. Your mother will soon share your face with you. The shard is mine. And all with their blood. Okay, so once again, Magda. Soon my mother will share my could my mother be alive after all these years? Probably. It's wise to prey upon your thoughts. Close your mind. And what is the power within you that she spoke of? This fight was too easy. She's toying with us. We must get back to Uncle Deckard right away. Okay. Grabbing the sword shot? Been changed. Our children are born weak and suffer short lives. The demon Nereza promised to restore their power. But instead, turn them into misshapen creatures and sent them to war against us. We may die, but not before she is sent back to the burning hells. Okay. So yeah, once again, Magda was looking for the, the sword piece, and that's the second time we've run into her now. So anyway, let's go take this glowing sword shard back to Decker Kane and see what he says about it. Um, I'm really annoyed with this lag. This game just lags so much for me for some reason. And uh, it's quite frustrating. Um, okay, to, oh, the stranger. Okay. I have the second piece of the sword. I remember a glow streaking towards a fishing village. That must be Wortham. Oh, brilliant, dear Leah. Have the ferryman take you there. Okay. Alright, so we've got to go to Wartham now to find the third piece. So let's go talk to the ferryman. Do I just sell anything? Oh, I'm sure you do, but we're just going to sell for now, mate. Oh, that was actually an upgrade. What was that? Oh, nah. I don't think that's worth it at all. Not for all the magic attributes that we lose in the process. So I might actually change back and... Might have Lashing Tail Kick with 
Vulture Claw Kick was the rune. And for this one, I might go back to Fists of Thunder with Thunderclap. There we go. Dashing Strike, can't change that yet. Blinding Flash. Yeah, we'll keep Blinding Flash. Right. So yeah, it's been a few days since I've played this game. Uh, I require passage to <coughs> Wartham. I will take you, but beware. Smoke rises from the village. Ooh. Okay, so we're here in Wartham. The town. Get out while you can. Okay. Oh, but it's holy. The town is burning. Oh, so there's a lot of dead bodies here. So something here is going on, like horribly wrong. Um, there's cultists here, which means Magda can't be far off, I guess. See, I've been trying to compile uh, a video about, I guess, it's sort of going to be like a review of this game. Um, I do have a few things I want to say about Diablo 3. Um, and they're not good things, necessarily, so... I mean, I know I've been talking up Diablo 3 a lot, and I've been like, oh, Diablo 3 is going to be the main focus of my channel and all that. But, um... I have to admit, like, if I were to just gloss over it right now, uh, Diablo 3 isn't, it's not what I was expecting, I'm going to be honest. Um, I was expecting more, and I'll just go ahead and say that much, but it's still a fantastic game, and I'm still enjoying it a lot, but like, yeah, well, I'm just going to read this. One of the men retrieved a strange artifact in his nets. It looked like a hilt of an ancient blade, Ooh. but I know it must be more. That's the piece of the sword. Argued with me, I'm guessing. But I convinced him to leave it in the safety of the chapel. Please, my family's hiding in the chapel with the rest of the townsfolk. We Kay. must get to them. We Don't will. Run off. You'll get to we will get to them when I explore this little area up here. If there's anything up here. Okay, just some gold. All right, so we're gonna head to the chapel from the book that we read and from this guy uh, claiming that his family's stuck in here or whatever. Seems pretty practical that we go to the chapel. Whoa, there's a lot. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Blood and flash. I can tell kick. Simple shit. Fools! You cannot keep the sword from me! This is bad. My servants okay. will burn this town to ashes! So this guy's molten enchanted. As you can see, when he walks, he's leaving like a trail of fire. He can also summon demons like that, I guess. Or hellions. Whoa, okay. Whoa, shit, potion. Whoa, 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 I can't believe I just nearly died. Okay, so these guys have the vortex trait. Um... And Vortex is basically like a death grip, uh, if you've ever played World of Warcraft. It basically just brings you towards them. But, uh, well, that was actually pretty hairy, guys. I can't believe that. I nearly died. Crazy. The hilt of a sword fell from the sky and glows with enchantment. Do you know of it? We found it days ago. I wish we'd never brought it here. Come, I left Virgil to guard it. We will be glad to be rid of it. Okay, so this guy here is going to give us the third sword piece. Alright, see you later, Leah. Okay. Alright, just check the bookcases. Never know. Virgil's dead. Um, okay. It's not here. While you were on your hero's errand here, I captured all three sword pieces and your friend. Whoa, what? I should have known. Ooh. I must get back to Kane's house. Okay, so we had two of the pieces, and now apparently she's got all of them, which means they must have infiltrated Tristram. Done something horrible. So let's head back to Tristram and see what's going on. But first, we will loot everything we can, as per usual. Okay. Alright, we're going to go to Kane's house. Which is up here, I believe. Yep. Let's 
something it's crazy is going on. Came. Either use your heraldric arts to repair the sword, or your dear Leah dies a horrible death. <sighs> oh, this pain, this destruction. What is the sword to you? To me, nothing. To my master, Belial, everything. Uh oh. Your rage is overwhelming, girl. You win this round, but if the sword cannot be mine, I'll claim the one it's bound to. In the end, the blade shall be mine. Uncle, you can't die. Nothing can stop that now. But there is one last thing I must do. The sword must be made whole. Just as I suspected, the sword is of the high heavens. The stranger is an angel. Heed the journal. The truth lies within. Uncle Deckard! Holy fuck. <laughs> okay, so some crazy shit just happened. Uh, so the stranger is an angel who has descended from the high heavens. Um, and we've just reforged his sword, so as to which angel it is, we don't know yet. Um, but Decker Kane's dead. So, Decker Kane is actually a, a very important character in this series, and for him to die, it's a pretty big thing, so. Anyway, let's see what Leah has to say. If only I could control this power, I could have saved him. Do not blame yourself. Magda is the one who must pay for Kane's death. Magda and her master Belial. The journal speaks of an angel falling from the heavens as the shadow rises from the abyss. The stranger is the key to all of this. Man, angel or god, we must find him and restore his memory. When my power erupted, I saw into Magda's mind for an instant. She's fled to the highlands. You can reach them through the caves above Wortham. You have to know, she'll be waiting for you. I do not fear her. Okay. Alright, so we're going to chase down Magda. So we need to... So yeah, she kidnapped the stranger, and we really need to get him back, because he could be the key to everything. So... Let's go chase her down. Okay. See, that's pretty crazy. Decker Kane died. Wow. I was so surprised when I saw that. Like, he dies so early in the game. You just... Oh. Just, you, did, you don't expect it at all, like, and then it just happens. But uh, nevertheless, we've got to push forward. Move on. And we've got to head to the Highlands and chase Magda. No, we mustn't. I love the idle banter that these guys have, like, I know I've said this multiple times, but I really do like it. <laughs> Uh, but as to what I was referring to before about Diablo 3 not living up to my expectations, it's just, it's more along the lines of when I compare it to Diablo 2. Like, if you don't compare this game to the second game in the series, which, you know, it's hard not to do that because, well, I mean, you know, you can probably figure that out for yourself, but it's just, it just seems like a bit of a letdown, kind of. Hello, Wanderer. I sell quality potions and dyes at a fair price. Have a look if you like. Oh, and would you do me a favor? There's a lunatic down by the caves who wants a potion to make his blood sweet, if you can believe it. Would you mind bringing it down to him? Sure. Deliver the alchemist's concoction to the hermit. Uh, okay. Not sure what this is all about. Um... But yeah, what I mean by that, like, it's it's really hard to explain. I don't want anyone to get the wrong impression that I hate this game or anything like that, because I don't. I do like it. It's just, 
in comparison to Diablo 2, it's just, it feels like there's less to do in this game. Um, anyway, here's the Kratom. I brought this potion from the alchemist. <gasps> this is perfect. My mistress will now accept me. Her blood and mine will soon sing as one. What the fuck? Okay. It's a bit creepy and weird, but... Whatever. Anyway, I'm going to release a video sooner or later about pros and cons of this game. According to how I feel about them. Whoa, there's a, there's a lot. Oh my god. Whoa, there are so many. Okay, so I'm lagging quite a bit, guys. So I'm going to have to stop this video soon. And, uh... I'm going to have to go ahead and... Just take a break, because I don't understand why I'm lagging so much. It's just... This is the only Blizzard game I play that lags this hard. Like, I can play World of Warcraft and Starcraft 2 and... Get no lag at all, but... But, uh, this game here just seems to have very bad connection problems for me. Okay, there's a treasure goblin over here, let's kill him. Spiders coming down on the ceiling. <laughs> right, so we killed him. Let's push these guys off. These guys are pretty tough. Okay. Got a few blues here. Nice one. Let's see if we got anything worthwhile. That gives us more health, but less damage. I don't not really interested in health at the moment, even though it wouldn't be a bad idea since I keep dropping low. Okay. Righty. Guess there's a boss over here. Okay, just down. Okay. So, I don't know what's going on here, but let's have a look in this chest. Cocooned victim, as well. Alright, let's see what's going on here. Oh, a treasure goblin, what the hell? There's a tre- he cocooned a treasure goblin? What the fuck? Okay. Fair enough. Spiders. Wow, I'm just taking loads of damage. I'm not really sure why. Like, what the hell's going on here? Oh, that's a big one. Not really a fan of this place since I hate spiders, but we'll make we'll make do with it. Okay, I'll grab that. Some champions. Nightmarish champions. Oh, but it feared me. No. Okay, they're chaining it. That sucks. Alright. Not to worry. Okay, what do you think you're doing? I wonder what it is about spiders that makes them so frightening. Like... I know I can just easily say it's their legs and how they all just... I don't know. It's just... They move in a very sinister way. When they, like, when they walk, like, oh my god, I can't, I just can't deal with it. It scares me to no end. <laughs> okay. Alrighty. Alright, so what's up here? Nothing much. It's a pretty big area. I don't know if I'm going to be bothered exploring this whole cave, but, uh, you know, I'll stop to break open these egg sacks at least. Let's head through here. Evil lurks in many places. It does. Beasts, even the hearts of men. Even in the hearts of men. Okay. 
Wow, I really feel like I'm lagging just an incredible amount. Um, I hope it doesn't affect the quality of the video, but yeah. So far, I haven't been really impressed with my Let's Play for Diablo 3. It's just there's been so many hiccups with um, lag and connection issues and, you know, among other things. Um, it, it's really a shame, it really is. Active skill unlocked. Exploding palm. Exalted soul. Okay, so we're gonna have to have a look at those things. Right. In fact, I might I may just teleport to town quickly and do a vendor run. And when we come back, I'll also make a new palm. Let's kill this thing. Okay. And when we come back, we'll keep exploring the spider cave, the caverns of Arane. As they're called up here. Okay. Alright guys, so I'm going to make a new part. Uh, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Catch you later.